Hi everyone, how are you? Welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. First of all, read the question. An ENT surgeon is performing a radical neck dissection. He wishes to fully expose the external carotid artery. To do so, she inserts a self-retaining retractor close to the origin. Which of the following structure lie posteriorly to the external carotid artery at this point? So we have to find out here that the a structure which lies posteriorly and laterally to the external carotid artery at the originating point of the external carotid artery. Here are the options. Options are the superior thyroid artery, internal carotid artery, lingual artery, facial artery, and none of the above. So we have to find out. <clears throat> one of the artery which is located posteriorly and laterally at the when the external carotid artery originated so here we can see um, these are the different structure at the neck this is the common carotid artery this common carotid artery is bifurcate into the external carotid artery and the internal carotid artery and here we can see the external carotid artery just posteriorly to the external carotid artery there is a artery which is the internal carotid artery and in this picture also here we can see this is the external carotid artery and internal carotid artery this internal carotid artery it lies posteriorly and it lies laterally so here this picture also have the external carotid artery uh, originating from the common carotid artery and here this is the internal carotid artery and there is no other important structure uh, close to this external carotid artery so our answer is the internal carotid artery so the internal carotid artery it originated from the common carotid artery in, and it lies posterior laterally relating to the external carotid artery thank you all